What if there was a boss that hits harder than the warden and has the health of 100 ender dragons? A boss so powerful you can't even kill it in creative. Because commands are at the center of this beast, it's smarter than every other creature. And I'm gonna survive 100 days with the wither storm and the time starts now. I have 50 seconds to run and it's important that I get as far away from here as I can, but I can't stop running after that because no matter where I am in this world, I will be constantly chased by the wither storm. It has multiple phases where eventually it will eat the entire world, but luckily I know how to kill it, so stay to the end to see the epic battle. Okay, that noise means it just spawned in and I need to run. So then on day zero, I continued getting stone tools and collecting some iron. Okay, this is huge. After all my stuff smelted, I slept the night away starting day one. On day one, after crafting all all my tools and armor and continuing to run, I found myself in a cave. But then the wither storm approached with its loud growl. Okay, I think that's the wither storm. I think he's here. He found me. He is not gonna stop chasing me, but I need to get my iron and but I'm underground. Hopefully, okay, yeah, he's definitely here. That's his boss bar. I don't think he can get to me underground, but I'm gonna go to the nether just to be safe. I know he can't get me in the nether. Yeah, I can't stick around for too long because I'm pretty sure he's gonna eat away all the surface ground and get to me sooner or later. But now the wither storm is in phase two. Now in phase two, the wither storm can pick up larger chunks of blocks, heal faster than you can damage it, and it has developed a tractor beam where it picks up other mobs on top of becoming stronger and chasing you down faster. Then on days two through three, I entered the nether and started collecting resources I needed to enter the end. Come on, come on, yes, okay. All right, I've got six rods, but I am going to be safe because I do not want to end up short and have to come back. So if this guy will just drop one last, yes, okay, okay, I'm, I'm, okay. Andermen are not supposed to spawn in this biome, but I'm gonna grab him just, just because. I do not want to die in here. Yeah, look at me, I know where all the gold is. Yo, pig step, isn't that kind of rare okay i think if i break this chest they're all gonna get in the hole oh no okay get in the hole no they're just they're distracted by that stuff this is in 1.19.2 so hopefully yes over a stack and of then pearls. on day four i had everything i needed and went back to the overworld if you don't know the wither storm is from minecraft story mode and if you haven't played the game the general gist is <laughs> So yeah, if you haven't played it, you're missing out. But yeah, this can already one-shot me and it will grow and get stronger the longer it's alive. After I got back into the overworld on day four, I started getting chased by the wither storm. I'm around to see how much damage this guy does. Oh, this guy chases me fast. It's nighttime and he's still chasing me. Okay. Okay, that's not cool. That, that's, mm, and a pearl. Please, 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 please. Okay. Oh, nope, nope, nope. That didn't do it. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, one heart, one heart, one heart. Pearl damage is too much in this. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I'm just dead. There's no way I survived this. How? How? How am I supposed to live? How am I supposed to live? Please, please help me. Oh my gosh. Why do enderpearls not work? Why do they not get me out of this view? Please. No, no. Okay, oh my God. What am I supposed to get with? Please, please. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Mm, mm, please, please. Let me live. Let me live. Let me live. Oh, oh, he dropped me for having. Yes, yes. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gone. I'm gone. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Please. He doesn't see me. No, nope, I'm gone. I'm gone. What is it? He's. No! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> oh. All right, buddy. I've just accepted my fate. It's you and me now. Oh, he's gone. Okay. Oh, my shield's gone. Oh, my. Sh I'm dead. I'm dead. He does like nine damage. Oh. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I live. I live. I live. I live. I'm gone. I'm gone. He doesn't see me. I'm gone. Oh my god, that was scary. Holy crap. Then as day four came to an end, I gained some distance and sailed away from the wither storm. Phase 3, the wither storm now has 3 heads and is impossible to kill with normal weapon. It inflicts illnesses on the player in nearby bobs that drain your maximum health. Only curable by killing withered mobs and using their drops to craft a golden apple stew. Then on days 6 through 7, I found another cave and began mining with a fortune 3 diamond pickaxe I found in the bastion. I gathered enough diamonds to craft full diamond armor and tools and then some. But then on days 8 and 9, I began locating the stronghold to go to the end. There he is. He's pretty far away hopefully i then found the stronghold and spent no time entering the end oh well yeah please okay so okay but realistically you've seen probably a thousand end fights so we're not gonna spend long here yeah you're gonna die now eat this bed yes mm, take that oh, okay not cool not cool oh even worse okay this is fine i can 
Mm, easy, easy. Goodbye. I got wither storms to kill. You're nothing. Then on days 11 through 12, I entered the end gateway and went to the outer end islands to get my elytra and tons of shelters. Okay, I'm gonna need quite a few of these because I need to carry everything on me I own. Okay, fireworks, that's what you are. Goodbye. Then on day 13, as I had my elytra, when I came close to the wither storm, I had an easy and fast escape. Okay, see, look at this. Ooh, okay, okay, it doesn't work as good as I thought. He still got me. Oh, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free. He's, look at that. That's so much easier. I'm never gonna die to this guy. This elytra is so OP. Yeah, you're a big ball of fat. Phase 4. The Witherstorm has peaked in size and now consumes more terrain than ever. And the Witherstorm will occasionally spawn a minion that can only be attacked from behind. This symbiote can shoot Wither Skulls, launch rings of fireballs, fire homing arrows, launching in the air, dealing damage on impact, summon evoker spikes, summon shulker bullets, and a wave of its own soldiers. On day 14, I began my quest for perfect enchanted armor. First starting out with an enchantment table, then finding villages to trade with librarian villagers. Okay, I found the strat. I steal all of their hay and then sell it right back to them. Ooh, looting two. Not bad. I think I'm gonna buy a couple of them. Yeah, I'd rather get looting two now. Then on the night of day 14, I spent the entire night farming creepers for gunpowder, for fireworks, and TNT. Then on day 16, I found my first mending book from a villager. Oh, yes! Okay. Okay, that's huge. Now I can repair my elytra. And these these give tons of XP, so it's gonna be- I gotta keep a lot of distance between me and him, because he's- Then on day 19, I had a couple of close encounters with the Witherstorm. However, he seemed to lock on to me whenever I used a firework. Then on the night of day 19, as I was hunting creepers, I suddenly got the withered sickness effect out of nowhere. Ow, what happened to my heart? I then got on Breaking 3 from a villager for a pretty decent price, which is one of the most overpowered books the villager can sell. Cell. Yo, Woodland Mansion. As I looted the Woodland Mansion, my goal was to not get hit by anything because pretty much everything in there did a sizable amount of damage. And with the Withered Sickness, I was already at low health. Oh my gosh, I hate Vexes. Get them out of here. <laughs> hey, those aren't bad enchanted books. I'll, I'll take them. I'll put them on my armor at one point in my bow. But now on day 20, I had put even more ground between me and the Wither Storm. Okay. Whoa, that guy just dropped a music disc. Holy crap. That's pretty cool. No, 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 no. Not this again. Please, let me go. I don't want to deal with- mm, Okay, okay, I'm fine. I got the totem. That's what I got the totem for. Holy crap, if I didn't have that, I'd be dead right about now. Hey, but the good news is I got rid of the withered sickness, so... And then on day 26, I found an ancient city with incredible loot, but also equal risk. And that's my third strike. That's a warden that's gonna spawn in. I'm out of here. Hey, another music disc. I need to collect these because I've already got quite a few. And that's another warden, but I don't care. Two notch apples. Oh my god. I don't even care at this point. The warden kills me, so what? I can run. I got a, a like. Oh, sweeping a tree. I'll take that. But I need. Ooh, that's a warden. Okay. I'm. I'm mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Oh, two more notch apples. Yes. Okay. Do they spawn in group? Then on day 27, I found another mending villager who sold mending books for 10 emeralds, and I bought every single book he had. I don't know when I'm gonna find this good trade next, so I'm buying them. Then all. on day 28, I found another ancient city, but this time I was gonna loot it for its experience. Dude, I'm not even trying to get notch apples. Bro, they just keep giving them to me. Oh my god, what are the chances? Then on days 30 through 34, I spent my time netherite mining. And got myself full netherite armor with perfect enchants on most pieces. I think I'm gonna do the sword and the pickaxe extra. Then on days 36 through 38, I found a pillager outpost and started my quest to get more totems. Yes, I need you with this stupid looking banner on your face. Oh, whoa, whoa. How? Have you ever seen anything like that generate in Minecraft? And there they are. Bro, get the stinging crossbow out of my face. Get out of here. You guys are all useless. Give me the real waves, man, where I get stinking totems. That's yeah, you're not so scary. Yeah, I'll take you. Yeah. Okay, he's got hired guards. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. Dude, I'm like a freaking fighter pilot. Oh my gosh, did you see that hit? Holy smokes. I'm a guy. Yeah, I think we're just gonna bow 
spam these people because I don't want to risk it. I don't want to die. Okay, punch dude, do your thing, do your thing. Mm, die, please, please. Okay. Oh my gosh, there's like 50 of the guys in here. Mm, okay, okay. Then on day 39, I lured the Wither Storm into an open field where I began my preparations to fight the Withered Symbiote. Okay, come here, buddy. Come on, follow me. Yeah, no, no, you're not allowed to do that. That's not- Now spawn in your little dude. There we go. Now I can absolutely destroy his- Yeah, take that. Okay, he doesn't take- Okay, he jumps, he jumps. Hmm, okay, okay, this is gonna be easy. Please, just make this easy. Can I- Hmm, okay, he doesn't- he doesn't take damage. What a sugar bullet, bro. I hate you. Oh my gosh. Bro, you fight like a wimp. Just let me take you 1v1. Get out of here with all this. Oh, I'm gonna summon a power up and okay, no levitation, no levitation. And now we got now we got Wither Skulls coming at us. Please, okay, okay, we're good. In from the back? Nope, nope. I can't even hit him. I can't hit him. Bro, just let me fight you. Bro, get out of here with this. I'm gonna summon my my freaking minions. That I'm already a minion who summons minions. Just fight me. Fight me like an actual dude, please. Mm, please stop, please stop. Yeah, you guys are useless. Get out of my life, please. Okay, okay. Ooh. Oh my gosh, I, that's like half health. Holy crap. He's under half health. From one hit, this is gonna be so easy. Not with the arrows though, maybe maybe the arrows might hurt. If he, if he can land a stinking hit. Oh my gosh, this guy is bad. Uh, oh, oh, you're close, buddy. You're close. Oh, you missed. Okay, they're all going right over my head. Okay. Oh, you got two more. Let's see if you can hit one. Nope. Are you going to... Oh, you're going to summon your own wave of stinking idiots now. You're a goon who summons goons. Like, mm-hmm. Yep. I see how it is. Okay, I can, I can backstab him now. Okay, I need hit crits. I didn't... Mm, I could have killed him there. But... Ooh, creeper. Okay, that did a lot of damage. It's not chapel time. Okay, now I'm, I'm definitely in, in, invincible now. Yeah, good luck trying to kill me. Okay, he's sucking me in. He's sucking me. Hit the two creepers. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. Not chapel saved me there. One more shot to the bag, and this guy is dead. We just got two skeletons. Well, a zombie and a skeleton. But yeah, uh, this is easy gonna be easy okay okay let me let me get out of this hole because he is being a complete idiot Ow, just let me fight you <sighs> okay i'm not allowed to get close to him he likes his personal space where'd he go okay oh okay he's dead right he's yeah yeah he's, he's gotta be dead and one creeper left <laughs> goodbye yes okay yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Is he gonna explode? Oh, okay. I got the book. I got the book. I got the book. After all of this, if you take out the symbiote, he drops an enchanted command block book. One of the key ingredients to craft the explosives needed to take down the wither storm. Then on day 42, I crafted a golden apple stew to get rid of the withered sickness, which I got from my last encounter with wither storm. And hopefully it'll cure me. <laughs> it did nothing. <laughs> That's such a scam. Then on day 42, I did a little bit more netherite mining, along with got ready to craft the Formida bomb. And when I came back to the overworld on day 43, the Witherstorm was camping my home portal. Not gonna hurt me. Like, we already know who's gonna win this fight. <laughs> okay, just let me go. It's not even funny anymore. Just, okay, I'm gone now. Goodbye. Why? Let me go, man. This isn't cool. I need to leave. Okay, thank you. Oh my gosh, I get like 10 blocks, and then this guy beams me up. Okay, I'm like 70,000 blocks out. I think it'd be funny if I just traveled through the nether to get back to spawn, and let this guy like 
really far away. Then on days 45 through 46, I got back to spawn and realized how much damage the Witherstorm left in its path. And then the following days, 47 through 58, I spent the entire time gathering resources to build Endercon from Minecraft Story Mode. The first major block I would need is granite. Okay, I think these guys sell polished granite, which is actually what I need, but I don't know if they do. Okay, they sell polished diorite, so that means they have to sell polished granite. It looks like they only sell one of them. Okay. So, so this dude sells me polished granite. I get a stack per trade. So then I got a bunch of villagers in a pit and began trading with them. But only a couple of them had the polished granite trade. Then the next thing I needed was a bunch of sand to convert into yellow stained glass. And after picking dandelions for 20 minutes, I had enough dye. But then I headed back underground to gather the stone I needed for stone bricks. And finally found an ocean monument to gather some prismarine. And then the last thing I needed was orange terracotta. Okay, I think I'm gonna put it right here and BAM! This was the building from Endercon, the competition where Jesse and his friends build against the ocelots. This is what I spent most of my time doing this 100 days, so I hope you like it. I didn't really finish the insides or the roof, and then I headed back into the nether to travel 70,000 blocks back towards the wither. With blaze rods, the command block book, and TNT, you can craft a formidabomb, an explosive which immediately starts a countdown after crafted. Within 10 minutes, you must place down the bomb under the center of the beast to take down the wither storm. Then on day 76, I crafted the Formida bomb and planned to kill the wither storm. Okay, I think I think this is about right underneath of it. And then I just place it down and, and light it, right? Okay, hope I don't die, because I think this thing can oh, I'm oh I'm definitely sure it could kill me. Wow, I'm surprised he didn't lock onto me as I was flying away. Okay, I think it's gonna happen, I, cause look at my screen, look at it. Okay! Oh, crap! Oh my gosh, my eardrums! Look at that big thing falling to the ground. There goes its si its heads. The sides. Dang. That was pretty cool. What a mod, am I right? Look at that! It's dead now! <laughs> I killed it! Let's go! I killed the stinking thing! That was easier than I thought. Oh my gosh, it's got its like arms in the way. What is this block? It's like slime, but I'm gonna go up to its head. Oh, there's there's a command block. Oh, I guess that makes okay, okay, it's moving. It's doing stuff. It's sucking me in. What? Can I can I get it? No. <laughs> okay. Okay, it's back. What? No. You gotta be kidding me! Bro... I mean, I guess it is what happened in Minecraft Story Mode, so... I shouldn't be too surprised. Okay, that it's time to leave now. Goodbye. Now, Phase 5. The Witherstorm has been reincarnated and splits into three bodies, and has nine heads in total. It will now summon another symbiote where another command block book can be dropped. Then on day 80, I ran into the Witherstorm again where it spawned another withered symbiote. Ah, there, there he is. And he's back at it. These mobs are just mostly easy to kill. I mean, they're just zombies. I mean, some of them have... What, a gold helmet, iron armor, enchanted with what, Prot 2? Maybe at max. These guys just have, well, I mean, some of them have different armor, but, ooh, okay, he's, he's low. I got him pretty good there, I got him pretty good. Okay, you're dead, you're dead. Any more, anything else you want to throw at me? Okay, there's one zombie over here. Okay, he's throwing, he's throwing with his goals. Little run. Does Bo do anything? Bo does not do anything, and he's, he's sucking me in. Okay, he's he's pretty bad at sucking me in, honestly. I have to I have to help him out. Okay. Okay, he's pretty strong. He's pretty strong. He deals a lot of damage. Okay. So all of his power-ups are trash, but if you get close to him, he does some pretty decent me melee damage. Get out of here, stinking spiders. Why are they are they bigger than normal or I feel like these mobs aren't correctly portioned. Like the creepers look kinda small. And the spiders are I don't know. Maybe I'm just going crazy. But they certainly don't deal any damage. Oh my gosh, he's pretty far down there. He's a pretty decent hole. I got two crits in. Okay, okay. I need to get out. Oh, wait. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I needed to run there. Because <laughs> remember last time I got close to him, I popped a totem. 
Now I can craft an amulet, a tracking device that always points towards the Witherstorm and says how far away he is. On top of this, you can also track three other mobs to its nearest location. Oh my, can he get out of the hole? Okay, he's dead. He's clearly dead. Think that. Okay, yes, yes, I got another book. Now let's just see if I can get out of here in one piece. Okay, we're already being beamed up. That's kind of unfair. Like, what do they expect? They expect me to just to kill this thing and then then at the end of day 80 i applied my command block tool to a diamond pickaxe and on day 81 as i was killing time before the wither storm grew into its final phase i found some goats and decided to farm them for their horns okay not bad not bad then with days 85 through 89 i spent most of the time mining for iron because i needed enough to make a beacon oh and, and there's some diamonds i mean i won't say no to those Phase 6. Now the Witherstorm has grown a portal in the center of its head, and after applying a command block book to a diamond tool, you can enter the portal. Inside, after you find the center, there will be a command block which you must strike with your command block tool to start the final battle. <laughs> okay, that is way too many beams. I cannot see anything. But I just got it out of the ground from mining, and <laughs> yeah, I did not expect this surprise. Holy crap, this man is huge. Just... Let me go, let me go, please. Please, I need to leave. I'm not dying. I am not dying on day 86. This is not gonna happen. Oh, please. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gone, I'm gone. Please. I get far enough. How did he see me? Please. Oh my gosh. He's got nine heads. It's like impossible to get away from this thing. Dude, I'm dead. Yeah. I made it this far and now I'm just, I'm getting destroyed by this. Okay. <laughs> I get like 20 blocks and then he finds me with one of his nine stinking heads. Like I can't get anywhere. Okay, finally, that took like five minutes of flying. And as I finished my final preparations, I flew right back to the Wither Storm on day 91 through 96 to start the final battle inside the Wither Storm's head. Okay, I, I kind of need you to let go of me. Okay, we're just gonna go. We're gonna go for it. Okay, I made it in. Okay, I made it in. <laughs> Whoa, this place is crazy. There's like trees. Now the right chest plate on. I don't want to take any chances. Oh, that's that's a dead zombie. Okay, there's quite a few. Can I like pick them up? No, I don't think I can. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. There is the command block. Holy crap! Can they like turn down the volume in this place? Okay, okay. That's what, what like a quarter of its health. Okay, here come zombies, skeletons, spiders. This, this wave is gonna be pretty easy, but this wave is not the one I'm worried about. If I, like, if I take a lot of damage on this round, the next round... Okay, I took off Fulbright. No, okay, okay, it's... Why? I need to... In the first phase, the command block will summon an army of withered mobs. Upon defeating them, you can strike the command block again, initiating phase two. Then tentacles arise alongside a final symbiote with more withered mobs. A final phase where Witherstorm heads turn inside to attack you. After defeating them in the army of withered mobs, you can strike the center command block one final time and are awarded the Withered Nether Star. Okay, maybe I need to end our pearl up there and then... Yes, okay, okay, okay. Oh, I think, I hope I don't fall down that pit. What? It's raising up. That's crazy. Okay, okay, I'm on a, I'm tentacles, hello. Okay, I swear to God if I get thrown in this pit. And there's a withered symbiote. Okay, that's just, there's a lot to fight right now. Please. Mm, creeper. Dude. Okay, I'm, wow, it's got me? It's good, okay. Mm, there's, there's like eight of these things, dude. I can't kill them all! Okay, I swear if it throws me into that pit. Mm, okay, 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 okay. I'm getting attacked by the stinging symbiote and like eight of its mobs. Mm, that's a lot of damage. Okay, okay, I'm in the block. Okay, I'm gone. I don't know where I am. Mm, okay, okay, okay. Half health. Uh, two hearts. Okay, notch apple down. We're good, we're good, we're good. One tentacle down, tentacle down. Oh my gosh. Dude, this thing is shulker bullets, I swear. Oh my gosh, there's no room to run! I can't... Mm. Okay, okay, focus up, focus up, focus up. Okay, there's just like, too much, too much. I need to get out. I need to get out of here. Okay, okay, okay. I can't, I can't hit him. I can't hit him from over. I don't know why I keep doing that. Jeez, what is this guy on? Oh my gosh, can I get rid of the stinking wither? Okay. Get a little bit of breathing room. Okay, I think this is the, this is the final wave. Mm, okay. Okay, that hurts a little bit. 
Okay. Oh my dang gone with these stinging tentacles. I had so many outside, I don't need them inside. Okay, 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 okay. Decent damage. How am I not dead? How am I not dead? Oh my gosh, I still have resistance from the god apple. That's how. Holy crap. Okay, this, this wave doesn't look too bad. Mm, okay, maybe never mind, never mind, never mind. Please, please, please. Okay, okay, oh, full damage. Creepers. Okay, okay, I think I got most of it. But there's one wave left. Gosh, this is gonna... Mm, this is, mm, please don't explode. Okay, okay. Minimal damage. Mm, okay, they're so dangerous, guys. Holy... Okay, last couple, last couple right here. Gosh. Okay. Last strike. Mm. Okay, okay, it's dead, it's dead. No more waves. I did it. I did it. Am I gonna die from the explosion? Please tell me no. Okay. There it lies dead. Look at all of that. I need to get some of this block real quick. And that, that's the nether star that he drops. That's what I did all this fight for. Yep, there it is. The withered nether star. There we go. With this, you can craft a withered beacon which has a higher range than normal and can be added with withered support beacons that offer additional effects infinitely in their direction. Okay, and now, now I can craft the beacon, I think, like this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, withered beacon. And then I spent days 98 through 99 crafting the withered beacon and collecting wither skulls to gather four regular wither stars to craft withered support beacons. And this should be the last block. Ooh, look at that. And it's got a bunch of not normal uh, effects too. And then this is what I, uh, I needed the nether stars for these guys. That's two on the redstone. Emerald three and then the last one on the and then the last thing I need to do is place down the last three wither skulls on on my beacon. Um Okay. Oh my gosh, what the heck? He's back! No!